Hey everyone, I'm Tish here and welcome back to yet another video of my channel. So it's been cloudy for like two weeks uh, ever since I uploaded my last video and it feels good to be back again. So tonight my target is Mazir 42 or the Great Nebula of Orion. So today's target is a deep sky object and thankfully we have a moonless night out but also a a very clear night so it's gonna be clear all night uh, and so far the weather is definitely clear so in order to take a picture of the Orion Nebula I'll be using my Orion Star Seeker reflector telescope which is right here um, and in order to photograph it uh, for the camera I'm using my ZWO ASI 224MC from ZWO Astronomy Cameras. So I'm using this this one because uh, this has a small camera sensor in it. So a small sensor means uh, the field of view is very narrow. So my plan is to capture the core of the nebula. So I'll be framing up my target uh, in Stel on Stellarium to show you guys uh, how the framing will look. But my plan really is to concentrate on the core of the nebula, which is the trapezium star cluster, right at bang in the middle of the nebula. And it is the brightest to part. So with a simple setup like this, uh, I can yeah, take some good images. Uh, and because it's a bright target, uh, it won't be a problem for my mount, which doesn't track very well. So yeah, let's just Okay, so this is my deep sky imaging rig tonight and my Orion Star Seeker for 130mm reflect reflector um, which is at a focal length of 650mm at f5 focal ratio and for the camera uh, I'm using my ZWO ASI 224MC which is the uncooled planetary camera which uh, I use for capturing planets and the moon so if you have seen my video last week uh, uh, taking pictures of the moon uh, I'm, I have used that camera for that but tonight uh, I'm going to capture Orion Nebula with it so it has a USB 3 port right here um, and this is gonna connect to my laptop up uh, so I'll be using sharp cap uh, software to uh, take my exposures so yeah let's just get wait for the night and start taking pictures right so here we are out under the stars uh, capturing the Orion Nebula right there so I've got my scope focused with the camera and I'm starting to take three second sub exposures. So that's a raw image you see right there. Looking good. And I can already see the faint gas and outer dust. Uh, and obviously the core is not so blown out. So that should be good for tonight. So my plan is to collect 150 of these images. So, so far I'm only done with about 85 of them so I hopefully I'll collect more and stack them for the final image